welcome back to Pray, Plan, Repeat. I am Chanel. Thank you so much for coming by and hanging out with me. So in a couple of videos, you are going to see the same exact look, you guys, because um, I had filmed the, the next portion of this clip of this video into different segments. So the first clip I want to show you guys, or the first uh, the part of this video, or the rest of this video, um, is actually me. I had went to Dollar Tree, and I wanted to pick up some items that you guys can start your little prepper or start pre um, prepping for just in case of an emergency that you should have on hand. Now, I did not spend no more than $30. I actually spent $30. A couple of the items are not on. <laughs> Excuse me. A couple of the items I did not show, like I bought a bag of brown rice and I bought um, a doggy bow and a doggy water bow. Those three items are definitely not being shown, but those were included in my haul. Uh, well, in what I purchased that I did not show you guys. Um, but I wanna show you guys that you guys can start from spending the least amount of money just to, sorry y'all, that's my phone. <laughs> the least amount of money to actually put stuff away for your prepper pantry to get yourself ready for what's about to happen or what may happen. I'm not saying nothing is happening. Y'all do not hear that from me. I'm not saying nothing's happening. I'm saying to get yourself ready for just in case if something like the start of a, the start of another pandemic, you know, like last year, 2020, um, if that was to happen again, you know, you're not rushing into the stores along with everybody else. So these are just a little bit of items that you can, you can even spend like $5 a week, $5 every paycheck, you know, slowly build up your inventory. Now, what I did not show is that you can also purchase, you know, start buying things for your, like your second pantry from Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree has canned goods. A lot of really name brand, really good canned goods there. Okay. They got ketchup. They got bread. I think they even got bacon and lunch meat too, okay, you guys? They got stuff to make pastas. I'm actually going to do another haul where I can show you guys, you know, the different things I picked up from Dollar Tree to add into my prepper pantry for that. They had toilet paper. They had tissue. If you have not been in a Dollar Tree, where have you been living, okay? Because you should know what Dollar Tree is, and you should have at least been in there once, okay? Even if you don't live near a Dollar Tree and you're on the West Coast and you're around... The 99 cent store, okay? That's no longer the nine, that's no longer actually 99 cent. But anyways, if you're over there, check, check the 99 cent store. Let me know what you picked up so I can see and probably I can probably, you know, get one of my sisters to pick me up some stuff and bring it to me, okay? All right? <laughs> anyways, let's go ahead and jump into the rest of this video. If you're not subscribed, please go ahead and consider subscribing and I'll talk to you again soon. Sorry, you guys. I am trying to get over this cold. I've been sick for like a month. I mean, not a month, a week and a half. Anyways, I did a Dollar Tree haul and I wanted to show you guys some items I picked up. Two of the items are not here because, um, yeah, my dog already got them. But um, I spent under $30 or about $30, something like that. And this is going to go towards my prepper pantry area. I'm going to find a spot and put, uh, you know, put this stuff in there. So... If you can't afford a lot of items like from Target and Walmart and, you know, big big name band stores like that, Dollar Tree is my best friend, y'all. I told my husband, I don't care how much money he makes, I don't care how much money I make, Dollar Tree is my best friend, okay? So I picked up a nightlight. You can't go wrong with having too many nightlights in your house, okay? All right. I picked up... This two pack of door stops. You never know when something's going to occur and you have to prop a door open or a window or something. So I just picked up some of these. I picked up some batteries. I got the C, D, and two triple, I mean, two double A batteries. I picked up some toothpaste here. I love shopping at Dollar Tree for toothpaste. The only thing is they don't carry my toothpaste, which is Sensodyne. Um, yeah, I saw this, the flea and tick spray. For those of you that don't know, we recently got a puppy. Um, we got him when he was two months old. He is almost five months now. Um, yes, I picked this up and I was like, you know what? Let's, let's, let's just get this, you know, never know. It might work, might not. It's from Nature's Best. Picked up some, you know, some toothbrushes. 
because you never know when you know I won't be able to actually replace the replace our toothbrushes with actual toothbrushes that you know we normally use so it's nice to have some on hand I've seen a lot of people with this milk from the Dollar Tree I wasn't gonna purchase any food items but if you are on a budget try Dollar Tree to start your prepper pantry with okay they have a lot they have a ton of food products there um, and especially if you don't have a big family it's just like you maybe like two other people or just one other person start with Dollar Tree so I wanted to try this milk out this 2% milk um, and the boys are actually going to try it out tomorrow and if they like it then I'm going to go ahead and um, try to get some more I picked up two of these Fabulosa bottles picked up some vitamin C um, drop, um, cough drops or these things here I actually picked up two of these downy things. I'm currently using one. I rarely use um, liquid softener. So um, it doesn't actually, there's no need for me to buy a big container of it because I will not go through the whole thing, not even in a year. So I'm just gonna be honest. Um, then this was the highest number I found of alcohol. So if you need to start a first aid kit, go to Dollar Tree. I have plenty of um, stuff for, for my first aid kit, so, but you can never go wrong with having more alcohol. I picked up some liquid hand soap. So yeah, that is pretty much what I picked up at Dollar Tree. That, that, that is my puppy. I locked him outside of my bedroom, so. But yeah, so that is what I picked up. So don't be afraid to shop at Dollar Tree, you guys, because you know, Something like this can help somebody and I I want I'm starting to prep items that are not food related okay but anyways thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you again soon bye